go ahead and start things off, Ben McKee. Eve, just with Sunday likely being your last game in Thompson Bowling, just how emotional of a day do you think it will be for you? Um, I mean, it's a big day in my life, you know, uh, last game in TBA. <clears throat> um, I'm excited to, to play for Ryder too. Um, you know, uh, it's been a, it's been an amazing four years and uh, I'm going to miss playing TBA. Gustavo, then Nicholas Hill. Eve, uh, how do you evaluate your time in at playing for Tennessee? You know, those years you play. What is the memories you're gonna, you know, remember? And you know, what are your evaluation of your time playing for Tennessee? You know, it's been a, it's been a amazing four years here uh, since I got here. Um, um, <clears throat> I got anything I, I wanted. Um, it was a great experience. I got much better in basketball. I developed my skills. And I uh, had the, the chance to meet amazing people. <clears throat> and um, it's amazing. I mean, you know, I come from another country. It's a new culture, a new language. Uh, so that was a fun, that was a fun experience. Eves, with one regular season game left, and obviously with the conference and NCAA tournaments coming up, what is the main thing that you personally are working on uh, to get better to help your team win as we get into postseason play? Uh, the main thing uh, that we focus on is uh, um, play to compete, play to win, and uh, play together as a team, find a chemistry, and um, trying to win, trying to execute in offense, play hard in defense. We're trying to get back to the team um, that we know that we can be, um, trying to play as uh, exactly the, the way we play uh, at the beginning of the season. <clears throat> and um, uh, yeah, yeah. Wes? Yeah. Hey, Eva, I'm wondering if you could think about maybe four years ago to now, just how much different are you, you know, both as a player, as a person, just how much have you, have you grown since, since that point? As a player, uh, I'm much more um, confident. Uh, I know what I need to do on the court. Um, I, um, you know, I, I know what I'm doing on the court. I know what I need to do. Um, I'm much uh, more skilled. I can shoot the ball way better than I used to. Uh, I mean, I put all my, my games on another level since my freshman year. And, um, yeah. Grant Ramey? Eve, when you think back to your first visit to Tennessee, what's kind of what sticks out in your memory is, you know, your first time on campus, seeing the arena, coaches, all that stuff when they started recruiting you? Okay. Grant, were you asking about his memories from his recruitment? Yeah, just when first time on campus when Tennessee first started recruiting him, all that stuff. Uh, well, my, my, my visit here, I mean, you know, I never seen anything like, like this before. Before I came here, everything was bigger. Everything was, you know, that was kind of like a like a TV show for me. I mean, I've been watching this on the TV shows, and now just <clears throat> when I first stepped on the campus, it was just amazing, you know, just because if it didn't feel well. It really didn't feel well. I mean, and seeing the arena, it was 22,000 22, seat. I only play in the arenas with like, what, 5,000. So it was just amazing to, to see it, uh, to see the facilities. And yeah. Back to Wes. Eve, when you sort of think about, you know, the, the way things have gone the past six weeks or so, how how important is it for you as a senior? I mean, assuming this is the, the last season for you, how important is it that things turn around from where they are right now? Um, you know, I think we still have a long way to go. Uh, we have to focus on the next game against Florida. And then going to the tournament is going to be like a new season. Uh, so we need to step up to uh, come together as a group and uh, play our, be our, be our best basketball because, you know, uh, one game at least, <clears throat> I mean, it's almost over. So we, uh, we need to give everything we got uh, so we can, uh, we can achieve our goals. And w with you, you know, personally, I know that, you know, from the outside looking in, it, you always seem to be a, a level-headed guy. You always have been. You've been calm a lot of times. How, 
the past few weeks, how have you kind of dealt with that, you know, internally? How, how, how does that, are you the kind of guy who it, it really bothers you and gets on you? Or are you a guy who kind of gets up every day thinking it's going to get better? Um, well, I'm not a really expensive guy, but I see a lot of things I can I observe and I just, you know, I keep it for myself all the time, but like, um, I'm the type of guy that's going to try to, um, you know, yeah, it kind of, yeah, it does, it does bother me, you know, I'm just, just not going to say it. Uh, I'm going to talk to a few guys, uh, trying to talk to coaches and trying to figure it out and trying to, to fix it. All right, waiting on questions. Go ahead again, Wes. Eve, if we were we were to ask you to be honest, how long did it take you to really adjust to being, you know, in America, being at Tennessee, being in Knoxville? How long did it take you to really feel kind of like this was a home away from home? Since I since I got here, yes. Yeah, just what was there a point where you said, "Okay, I kind of feel comfortable here now"? Um, almost a, a year and a half, I would say. Yeah, like uh, the middle of my sophomore year, I would say that. Was it something that just built over time? Was it just something that sort of gradually happened? Yeah, it gradually happened, you know, because I had to, I had to adjust. First of all, I came late, uh, so that was a big, um, a big thing, a big deal because I missed most of the, uh, the summer camp, summer school, and uh, I had to adjust with the language, uh, with the new way to play. I mean, I mean, the, the basketball here is different as European basketball, so I had to adjust in that. So it took me a little bit while to, to, to adjust. All right, last call for questions for Eve. All right, Eve, thank you very much. Thank you.